The Corsair one is designed to be compact, so it might seem a little daunting to get to some of your components. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to swap out your hard drives and upgrade your DRAM modules. All you'll need is a standard Phillips head screwdriver. We also recommend some soft materials to prevent scratching. Be sure to back up all your data before updating your system. To access the components inside your Corsair One, press the release button and pull the top assembly straight up. Disconnect the DC voltage connector and set the top assembly to the side. Now, with the Corsair One facing away from you, we'll release the left side panel. Grab your screwdriver and begin by removing the first of two screws. Remove the second screw while resting your hand against the side panel as it will pop open. With the side panel removed, carefully lay the Corsair One on its side and rotate the CPU hoses so that the panel can be laid parallel with the Corsair One unit. This is where the soft material comes in handy. I like to use foam to prevent scratching and give myself more space to work. Now you have access to most of Corsair One's components. From here, we'll replace the boot drive. If you plan on upgrading this drive, you'll need to reinstall Windows. This drive holds your operating system, so please proceed with caution. Place a finger on the corner of the drive. While holding the drive, disconnect the SATA cable. Then, remove the SATA power cable. From here, I suggest propping both cables to the side. There's a release latch on the opposite side of the SATA cable that will release the drive. Once removed, you can drop in your new SSD. Start by sliding your new SSD carefully into the caddy until you feel a click. And plug in the SATA data cable and the SATA power cable. Next up, we'll get to the expansion drive. Start by turning over the side panel to gain access to the bottom of the chassis. If needed, reposition the radiator hoses so that you have more room to work. This will also be helpful when replacing the DRAM. Remove the Corsair link cable and disconnect the power cable from the motherboard. Click the release latch and remove the expansion drive from the caddy. While holding the drive, disconnect the SATA cable. Then, remove the SATA power cable. Take your drive and attach the SATA data cable, then the SATA power cable. Now slide your new drive carefully into the caddy until you feel a click. To replace the DRAM, start by flipping the latch on the left side of the DRAM slot. Pull the memory up and out of each slot. To properly insert the memory, make sure the logo is facing towards you. Now, when inserting the first module, place the right corner in first and click the module into place. Repeat this process for the next module. Now, plug in the Corsair link cable. Finally, connect the power cable back to the motherboard. In order to close the side panel of the Corsair One, put it into its standing position. Insert the bottom of the side panel into the latch. You may need to adjust the radiator hoses to close the side panel completely. Once everything is properly positioned, hold the side panel in place and replace the screws. Connect the DC voltage connector to the top assembly. Place the top assembly into position. Be sure to tuck in any excess wiring. Give the top assembly a slight love tap to lock it into place, and you're good to go.